is the final poem. The several words I have. You will never understand, try as you might, a person other than yourself controlling an altogether different set of limbs. She was removing her galoshes in the wet, insipid light. He was setting the table for one, creasing the calm paper napkin. The world has lost its winters. We glisten in the sun. Each one of us a shiny obstacle to someone. Is it the end of empathy? Of history? Who, at this point, navigating their browser through acres of weather, has anything requiring being said? Why share a knowledge no one wishes for? And is a poem just a crack in time? Or is a poem time itself continuing? I may have mistaken motion for action and action for proof, romping each night around the phosphorescent dance floor, once a pretty dress in a pretty hat, once a rumpled frog under the awnings and parapets. My very appearance at court caused astonishment. Now I recline in my corner, delicate and mute, sheathing myself in a leather-bound chair, shushing the migraine. For whom did I mistake me? A president of some sort? For who am I? A whistle in the exhaust? It is all nevertheless. I fail to tire of it. I let go of the several words I have.